doesn't well. even include homeschoolers who opt out to the next level that and too. say, we don't even live in America. We live in, we live in waiting for Jesus land. Right, which is not permitted and, and in that, Europe. Uh, you know, and, and, and so what's happened in America, which I, and I agree completely with what you're saying, is the influence of not just religion, but this polarization that came through the 60s, 70s, and 80s really, really means that we have lost on all sides this idea of public space, something that belongs to the idea of the old Italian piazza. No, you can you can be in the Communist Party or you can be in the right wing party, but the old guys are out there in the piazza arguing. This is a public space that belongs to all of them. Our public school system no longer belongs to everybody. There's people who think it's the work of the devil. Mm -hmm. They're homeschooling their kids. Our media doesn't anymore. They all listen to people who only agree with them and they don't even listen to other points yeah. of view. And I think going back to your point, one thing that's so evident, and that is one reason that, that uh, President Obama, of whom I'm a big fan, as you know, has had a lot of problems is exactly what you say. I think he underestimated the level of mm. polarization. Mm. He underestimated the fact that to be a reasonable human being in this country makes you a minority and not in the sense of him being the first black president. Mm.